Today is Grin Customer Profile Day and I'm here at Land Yachts to meet with one of our favorite customers who we've been meaning to do a profile on for a little while. His name's Aaron Brown, he's the engineer. Let's go meet Aaron and see what he's up to with his electric bike setup. Yo! Are you gonna interview? Aaron! Hey! How are you doing? I'm doing good. Wee wee hours, I was rolling slow because of on a skateboard truck uh, called the Grizzly Bear for, for land yachts. Um, it's just like a skate deck with a little ski attached to the bottom of it. You plug it in uh, using this magnetic port and it uh, heats that element inside the saddle, you know, softening the thermoplastic. Mm -hmm. You sit on it and it creates small indents for your sit bones. I used to live right down the road, but uh, I you know, wanted to invest in a property. I got married and uh, couldn't, couldn't really afford the housing out here. So uh, my wife and I looked uh, about 30 kilometers away, 20 miles away, where, the, where housing was a lot more affordable. Um, you know, great, got a mortgage, moved in, uh, but ended up having a pretty arduous commute in every day. Um, you know, sitting in traffic for you know up to three, four hours each day. You know, I show up at work miserable and got home and I was exhausted and hated humanity <laughs> so um, yeah I needed a solution basically to uh, you know, to get into work with, with a smile on my face. At first you know it was tough there was a lot of dead ends and uh, paths that didn't work out but yeah. eventually like you get this like perfect route mm -hmm. and you just like uh, becomes autopilot. I basically had to design the, the bike for my commute. I was going through so much different terrain from like swampy water and rain to you know bumps and rocks and sand and all sorts of stuff. So um, and then the other half of the journey was a lot of roadways and sidewalks and stuff. So mm -hmm. um, yeah, I needed a bike that would work for, for all those different types of environments. But yeah, so this is the newest, uh, the newest one that I built. It's a cross-country Cannondale Profit bike. Uh, and I put the motor in the front, and then I've got a phase runner controller right here up on the top tube, and I run an extension from the controller that I can plug into a backpack. It's an Anderson connector, and I've got a little bridge that keeps it from pulling off too easy. Go around, lights for safety, no lights, lights everywhere. Super fun. It beats the hell out of driving a car every day. I can get to work uh, an hour like consistently each route. Yeah, and a lot of it is uh, like total off-roading. Yeah, it's nuts. It's like uh, like you, people don't believe me when I when I explain it. Everybody thinks I'm exaggerating, but I, I literally like, ride through a swamp through through part of the ride. bag that I keep the battery in. So right now I am running some Grin LIGO battery packs. So I just like uh, got them all taped together here. One, two, three, four, five, six of them. So that gets me pretty safely through, uh, you know, that 35 kilometer commute each way. I have to charge it at home and, and at work at the end of the day. But um, these are great because you can, you can design your battery pack to your journey, right? So if you need a little bit more, you can pick up a, uh, another pack. If you, you know, you have a bunch of extra juice at the end of the trip, you can uh, slim down the weight and get kind of design that exact amount that you need. Mm -hmm. Pump and a tire, like an emergency kit with some band-aids and um, Neosporin and all that kind of stuff in case I crash, which mm -hmm. has happened. <laughs> My wallet, just to keep it dry during the wet ride. Some backup headphones. 
some tube scabs, in case they get a flat, like a backup throttle, yep. just in case you don't get snagged. Get a USB charger, so I can charge my phone. A little tiny tool, tire levers, little tire jimmies. And I've got some zip ties and a cutter. And a bomber pin for a discount beer. Okay. Always useful. Important. <laughs> And uh, hand wipes, so when you're, you're changing tires and you get grease all over mm -hmm. your hands, you can clean your hands off. Yeah. Yeah, so that's my... Awesome, so that's your daily commuter kit, other than the rain yeah. gear. Yeah, exactly. I get a bit of exercise out of it as well, because um, one side effect of getting married and moving away is also getting fat. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I also got, got a bit of fitness every day just, just on the commute, which is nice.